quadratic equations. In this video, we're going to expand and simplify the brackets. I'm going to show you a couple of different methods, the second of which has a few variations to it. The first method is my favorite and the one I like to use the most. It's the grid method. We're going to expand and simplify these brackets. Now we've got x plus four and x plus six, a pair of brackets. And what these mean when they're next to each other is we're going to times them. So it means everything in x plus four is going to be multiplied by everything in x plus six. So that in the grid method, we're going to draw out a grid. I'm going to input x plus four into the top bit and x plus six into the side. So this is basically a multiplication grid. Firstly, I'm going to do x multiplied by x, which equals x squared. Next, I'm going to do four multiplied by x, which equals four x. Then I'm going to do x multiplied by six, which equals six x. And finally, I'm going to multiply four and six together to get plus 24. So now we need to write all these terms out. So we have x squared plus four x plus six x plus 24. Now we've expanded the brackets, we need to simplify this expression. Well, there are no other x squared terms and there are no other constants or numbers without variables. However, we have an x term here and another x term here. So these two can actually be simplified to 10x. So altogether, we have x squared plus 10x plus 24. And there's a final answer expanded and simplified. I'm going to show you the next method with the same question, which we need to expand and simplify. Now this method has many variations to it. So I'm going to show you a few of these variations. The first one is called the claw. And it's called the claw because you're going to draw one claw, which is x times x is x squared. The next claw, which is x times six, which is six x. Then we've got the next claw, which is four times x, which is four x. And the final claw, which is four times six, which is 24. At this point, we can simplify the expression which is x squared plus 10x plus 24. Another version of this method is the smiley face. So two eyebrows, a nose and the smiley face. And another method is foil, which is first, outside, inside, last. First, outside, inside, last, which pretty much just looks the exact same as the claw. To be honest, my favorite method is the grid method. I think that's the best one to use and it's the easiest to use. So here are a couple of questions for you to practice with. Pause the video, give them a go, and we'll go through the answers. So the first question, x plus four, x plus seven. I'm going to draw the grid at the top, x plus four, and at the side, x plus seven. x times x equals x squared. x times four equals four x. x times seven equals seven x. And seven times four is 28. Next, I'm going to write this expression out. So x squared plus 4x plus 7x plus 28. And that becomes x squared plus 11x plus 28. There's our final answer. Second question, 2x plus 3 and x minus 5. I'm going to draw out my grid. I've got 2x plus 3, which I'm putting at the top, and x minus 5, which I'm putting at the side. Firstly, I'm going to do 2x multiplied by x, which will equal 2x squared. Next, I'm going to do 3 multiplied by x, which will equal plus 3x. Then 2x multiplied by minus 5, which will equal minus 10x. And finally, 3 multiplied by minus 5, which is minus 15. Write it out. So 2x squared plus 3x minus 10x minus 15. We've expanded the brackets and now all we need to do is simplify. So our final answer will be 2x squared minus 7x minus 15. And there is our final answer expanded and simplified. And that's all for this video. We've expanded the equation, we simplified the equation and we've checked the question each time. Stay safe and healthy and I'll see you in the next video.